Last night I couldn't sleep I got up and started walking Down to the end of my street And on into town Well I had no one to meet And I had no taste for talking Hello from Manassas Gap Shelter, Virginia. So today we got up at 4 a.m. and we made the drive down. And um, went back to the original plan. So sorry, Ashby Gap was going to stay at Dickstone, which is about four and a half, maybe just under five, don't remember now, uh, miles from Ashby Gap. But instead, we came to Manassas Gap Shelter not the greatest tent sites and there's a lot of people um tenting there's a whole group that took like the best tent sites by the time we even got here um so um we crossed a stream today just before dick's dome called crooked run i got all the way across it it was like really wet because of all the rain got all the way across it and just as I'm standing, contemplating my next move with my foot to make sure I didn't fall in, my foot went in completely. So, shoes soaked, socks soaked. Oh well. Say la vie. So anyway, so um, the other issue I've had is that my Nemo tent that I love because it's so light has little holes in the mesh and I'm not too thrilled about that. Um, especially, you know, since... I really like the weight of it. I like the space of it. So, anyway, so tomorrow's another day, and it's 14 miles, roughly. And then uh, I think I'll have it on Monday. So, I'll try to do more video diaries tomorrow. So, peace out. Good morning! We got out of camp in a record 33 minutes this morning. Hiked about a mile and a half before we stopped for breakfast, so... Yay! Kudos to us. Kudos to us and kudos to whatever Trail angel magic. left these sodas. This is the best damn Dr. Pepper I think I've ever had. And I am super proud of myself because... What did I do, monkey poo? You climbed a hill. I climbed out of Manassas Gap to the meadow without taking a break, which is very hard in 95% humidity, but I did it and I'm so excited. The stairs at work must be paying off. Anything to add, monkey poo? All right, peace out. So hey from Tom Floyd Wayside Shelter. Um, so we had a pretty good day today. We got up at um, 4.40 this morning and got broken down within half an hour, which I think I said on the last video. Um, we ran into a couple that we had uh, met at the shelter last night at around Mosby Camp. We were taking a break and they came up and so we ended up hiking with them today, uh, which meant a sustained pace, which meant over two on the uphills. So I took that for a while until like mile 11 or 12 and then I was like, I need to sit down because we hadn't eaten lunch yet and my asthma was starting to bother me. So anyway, um, so we had a good day. We had a lot of fun. Um, it was great hiking. And we left uh, and parted ways at Ginger Spring right before we got to the shelter because they were still going to go on to Gravel Springs Hut. So and then we got here and we were the first ones here because we got here really early, like I think it was like 3 o'clock because um, we made pretty decent time and we had our brakes under control and stuff. But anyway, so 
then some hikers came in and we sat around and talked for a while and tomorrow's our last day on trail for this trip and we have about ten and a half miles to go tomorrow to Gravel Springs Gap where we will leave off for this trip and there is monkey poo want to say something on the video? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so anyway so tomorrow's another day everything's working out pretty good and uh, no major or minor meltdowns over sharing tent stakes or tent space stuff so anyway peace out so last day out um, we have 10 point something miles to go to Gravel Springs Gap and it's 98% humidity and 63 dew point and it's mostly uphill so I call that an asthmatic hikers nightmare but it will be okay, we'll take it slow. We got up super early so we could give ourselves 12 hours to get it done. So, um, anyway, cause it's gonna require a lot of rip breaks. So anyway, it's been real. Try to update along the way. So, um, sweet and no leave. Peace. Peace out. We had an awesome time.